Hey everybody and um, welcome back to Fruitini's channel. Um, again, first of all, sorry for the poor quality of the video. I'm recording this on my iPad and I know the sound quality isn't that great on my iPad, but I have had um, a couple of um, questions in um, some of my comments um, as to what I use for a portfolio. So before I um, get my paintings ready to be framed I need somewhere to store them so this actually came from I actually bought this from not Hobbycraft the range um, in the UK I'm not sure if you get um, a similar kind of store in the US or in other parts of Europe but this is where I keep all my completed diamond paintings whilst I'm waiting for uh, for them to be framed um, it's made by a company called West Folio. I have absolutely no idea how big this portfolio is. Um, all I can say is it's pretty huge. If you've seen my um, my peacock diamond painting, that's a 50 by 82 centimetre. And there's probably around an inch from the, from the end of the canvas to the actual end of the portfolio and it's got a slightly longer length so it is pretty pretty huge i don't think oh it has has it no it doesn't have um it doesn't have a size on it which is quite strange um but, but what i will do is i'll try and link um the the product on the uh, in the description um i know this isn't my usual style of video but i had a few comments of what people how, what people had asked um, in terms of how I store my diamond painting so this is it um, it is really big um, but I find it really helpful before I start um, framing my paintings um, it's held together by by velcro Okay, and all my diamond paintings are inside here. All my completed projects are inside there. Okay, that's the wolf that I was just working on. Um, the peacock, if you recall me working on that one. And somewhere in the middle of there is an owl that I was working on before that. So, um, so yeah, that's where I store my diamond paintings. I know the quality of this video isn't great, but um, I thought I would just try and quickly show you guys exactly how I store them. So, so yeah, it's um, pretty handy. So I will put a link in the comment in the description box just to um, to link exactly where I bought this from. Hopefully that will give a few dimensions as well to give you an idea of size. But yeah, there we go. This is where I store all my diamond paintings when they're done. So, thank you for watching and I'll see you again in the next video. Bye-bye.